Hi, I'm Carolyn, trichologist here at Absolute. We're just going to share an unusual hair loss problem uh, that we came across. And we share this because of Dr. Google. Okay, so if something's happening to your hair or scalp, you really do need to get a professional diagnosis because it can be so misinterpreted with all the information um, online. So for this particular case, um, we had uh, various circular patches of broken hair at scalp level. Now anyone will look at that and say it's alopecia or it's alopecia um, areata. So visually it, it can appear like that. The doctor had said the exact same thing, but we kept getting more patches. So I guess that's how I came across meeting um, this particular client. So I used my microscope. We went in at 60 times magnification and what we physically saw was nothing that you would normally see with a typical clinical case of alopecia. So as a trichologist, we understand what the clinical forms are. For this particular one, you can see the hair follicles are actually intact. Now with alopecia, they generally are not. And if they are, they have exclamation mark hairs, meaning they're actually single hairs with a little round tip. These ones, you can see they're actually little corkscrews. Okay, so this is typical of something called tinea capitis or well, basically it's a form of ringworm. Now it can happen anywhere on the body, but when it affects the scalp, you will always see this particular formation um, under the scalp. Now it needs to have medical assistance. So it took us quite a while to convince people that it was not alopecia and that it was actually physical tinea capitis um, or ringworm uh, to get the proper treatment, which does need to be um, medicated. Okay, so once it's stopped, um, actually spreading and we don't um, have any more infection and we can actually um, clear everything up then we can help people to get the proper hair uh, growing back to normal uh, as well but you know in these sorts of cases if you're not sure always always get a correct diagnosis so if you've got any unusual hair loss problems or would you like to know more about this particular case always feel free to drop me an email it's info at absolute.com.au